What's up, boo? Welcome back to my channel. I hope y'all have a great day. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to the dark side because today we are checking out some, some new mods for The Sims 4. And I just can't wait to show you. I like new and cool things in the game. So yeah, let's go ahead and just uh, jump right in because we are with our Sim, Krista. And the first mod I want to show you is from Arnie who has made their return. I don't know if you saw that announcement, but Arnie is back. And they have went ahead and updated one of their mods ahead of their new mod pack that's coming out so the lux light mod kit got a refresh and this gives you some new and improved lighting in the game with some variety of different light sources that you can have 17 new lights and i'm gonna go ahead and just delete all the lights i have here because we need to see exactly how good these lights are i'm gonna turn off my reshade so i think that's all the lights in here with minus the head lights that come with that uh counter okay so we got some bulbs here so do we have a shorter okay it's a longer bulb okay here we go i think that kind of works oh with these longer bulbs it's always a hit or miss because i don't i, I can't really um the height okay and then i think the shorter bulbs in here for the kitchen let there be light Ooh, it's already nice and bright in here mm, this is a led strip for down here oh you can put these at the baseboard that oh perfect that really sets the mood floor and table light oh so you can put this here so i guess if you have a table this is a small light strip oh so maybe if you have i'm gonna put this above her bed because why not then let's take the lights out real quick i'm gonna be so upset when i don't save or if i accidentally save and i take this mod out so i can you know go to the next mods and she has no lights in her apartment you know it'd be like this sometimes i wonder how that's gonna work all right there's a light specifically i want to see i'm gonna leave that light here. i'm gonna leave those lights right there this is the floating moon lamp so arnie wasn't really happy with the first version of this lamp now they've like improved it so it rotates spins and it lights up it didn't it didn't do a lot of those features before so that's good vertical light strip uh maybe here and then these hexagons which you can <laughs> oh <gasps> oh that's so cool and then there are some uh, square ones so we can do this maybe okay don't do that bad that's vet don't, that's that that's bad don't do that you do like this cluster that's so cool nice little honeycomb here low key yeah, yeah you don't need that one right there <laughs> okay uh is there anything else i got the string lights i got this i got this neon put this in the kids room because why not you know boom all right, so has a whole new menu. First of all, I like the glow. Let's turn off the reshade real quick. Okay, got a nice little glow here. I think, actually, I don't think anything. Now, I read there's also a feature that the lights change as the day goes on. So as it gets nighttime, they will adjust, I believe. And turn, okay, is this off? Oh, yeah, turn on, turn off. I like that. Uh, set color intensity all hexagons oh you can control the hexagons like this let's do set color intensity this hexagon maybe a red then this hexagon orange uh blue oh well that's that, that purple and blue don't do it yeah maybe a yellow Ooh. let's do set color intensity i don't know which square i picked but we're just gonna roll with it okay that color intensity this maybe a green that's so cool oh like the strip lights set color intensity all leds green oh look at that uh all leds the blue maybe that blue Ooh, some mood lighting mood lighting has gotten better in the sims 4 this is amazing the mod is available for download go check it out but let's move on to the next mod this led strip i, I, I forgot these led strips right here this is yeah cool i love it all right all right the next one i want to show you comes from grumpy and it is their more wheels of games in the sims 4 so you get a handful of new games that your sims can play so let's play some games and let's play fortnite because low-key all right mm, it's been a minute since i played fortnite i used to be a fiend for fortnite i spent so much money in that game <laughs> and you actually have 
Oh my god. Playing Fortnite at 6 a.m. on a Wednesday. The good old days. I don't even know this map. What, what, where did this tunnel come from? Please explain. Can she join too? Uh, not the kids coming in. Not the kids saying there's Fortnite. Can they join in? Join party frenzy. Wait, hold on. I guess it overrides party frenzy. Now everybody's playing Fortnite at 6 a.m. <laughs> okay oh you know it'd be really good okay hold on, hold, on, hold, on, hold on i have an idea my sim does not need a dresser for the simple fact that i have mc command center so i'm going to add a desk in here i feel like we need some new desks like some better desks i don't know some more updated desks in my opinion let me add some money and let's add this gaming monitor that we got from high school years and then the nice comfy chair but she's gonna come in here play more games and start playing animal cross actually no play stardew let's do stardew valley not two players okay play stardew valley let's play stardew <laughs> day one summer it's the sound effects for me and there's also character bubbles and apparently you can even play two players with this but you know we're gonna play by ourselves not you in jojo mart let me know in the comments below what games are you currently playing besides the sims <laughs> or if you're not playing anything else you're just playing the sims and that's fine too but i want to know that is the more realistic games mod from grumpy go check it out but let's move on to the next mod all right we had to go to high school because the next mod is for teenagers and young adults it is the ask to learn how to kiss interaction from simkatu now this mod is so cute and i just had to try it so we're gonna follow houston hold on we need the the reshade because you know we need the reshade back on and they're gonna ask someone how to kiss now you can only be in a flirty confident playful or dazed mood and it only works if you have reached the good friends if you are not related <laughs> and if you are not dating or married yet oh so that's that's how that's gonna go choose a sim i feel like cassandra hello cassandra let's do a romantic introduction real quick because we gotta be in a flirty mood and we have some free time she's like this is going to be the worst day of her life probably most likely Houston is now flirty and he's good friends with Cassandra so it popped up the romance affection and then it says ask to learn how to kiss and this is so cute it's like a cute little mini mod that you can add she said yes um, she's like I can't. she's like i guess why why is wolfgang Wolf, wolfgang what are you doing oh wolfgang <laughs> wolfgang's like nice form because you could be a bit better oh i like the animation where it's like okay how was that that's so adorable does this look like a new bus bit of a mess i'm screaming i think i felt something during the kiss are we just friends or something more i don't know anymore i'm <laughs> you know that happens sometimes now it's now he doesn't know and she just walked off she's unfazed period cassandra love that she's like i am cassandra Sorry, goth ah! wait wait what's going on here wait is he jealous <gasps> does he have a crush on houston is that what this is he started just yelling at everybody <laughs> i feel like he does he Ooh. Huh. not a brewing room not a wait 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 why did he stand behind houston though wait wait wait. what is this tea we don't have time for this we don't have time i don't have time <laughs> i don't have time for this storyline real quick wait uh, i'm so oh i really don't have time for this storyline okay anyway but yeah that is the ask to learn how to kiss mod from simkatu go check it out but let's move on to the next one all right we're back with krista and the next mod i want to check out is the virtual vir virtual therapy mod from l sims world this allows your sims to go to virtual therapy from the comfort of their homes or wherever they are so your sim has a new app called sim mind care hmm. so you sign up from the computer and then it says sim mind care and then it says registration package options and then you choose the package that you want which i believe has different options if i'm not mistaken so there is the balance wellness package basic or then holistic healing let's do holistic healing you know we're checking this mod out may as well go out um, and also pay our bills because we 
haven't done that either we're spending 500 on on this we need to pay our bills okay okay now we have to do the mental health assessment i actually gave her a notification Hol holistic wellness package thank you for purchasing the holistic wellness package in addition to all the features from the basic and balanced plans you now have access to our self-help library emotional intelligence exercises and our support group programs love that how am i overdue on my rent and i paid my rent explain i've done that you need to get out of my face all right oh and we also get a buff new beginnings joining virtual therapy has krista feeling hopeful and excited taking the step toward personal growth is a big move and the possibilities for healing and inspiring Ooh, and her assessment is complete so therapy portal now we can attend group therapy sessions we can uh, speak to therapists on a video call view customized therapy report or speak with a therapist in a private chat room here are some resources research coping mechanism talk and support group chat rooms access the self-help library or work on therapy worksheet um, let's private chat room my therapist real quick a quick 11 a.m session you know and let's see if we get anything out of that i don't think she did oh she got a buff i'm fine not really krista feels super calm after that session this whole therapy thing might actually be worth it Ooh. okay now let's go check out the chat rooms is it under resources yeah talk to group chat rooms because i know there's a lot of options so we have a general chat room the single parent support chat room the veteran support chat room the university student support chat room survivor support break support and grief support Ooh, i love this i wonder if this will go well with the um the new expansion that's coming up uh let's do the single parent because technically she is um don't ask who the father of her kids are because we made them <laughs> in cast and their parents in the void so <laughs> don't ask okay let's see what buff did we get all right comfort and shared struggles the support from the chat room lifted krista's spirits knowing there are others out there with similar experiences makes everything feel a little lighter oh i love that maybe a video call now sim care therapy portal let's do a video call <laughs> like we need to talk to our therapist just a little bit more just a little bit longer you know okay did that do anything i don't I think we got another buff for that but i could be mistaken then let's check out sim care therapy portal view customized therapy report just one more thing falling behind the therapy report shows chris has fallen behind in certain areas it's tough to face the fact that things aren't improving as quickly as expected oh i hate that for her that is the virtual therapy mod from l sims world go check it out but let's move on to the next mod all right we're back with houston and i thought it would be a great environment to check out this next mod and this is the friend zone mod from sasha space so the friend zone mod adds buffs to the ask to just be friends interaction in the game your sales will now feel a way about being friend zone if the interaction is positive both sales will have positive moolets but if the conversation is negative then both sales will have negative moolets also your sales will get a milestone and a special milestone buff for friend zoning a sin in the milestone the sim will remember the location and who they friend zone i'm screaming so there's 32 new buffs with this now we don't mm, who can we friend zone we just got something with cassandra so let's do oh, let's do the first kiss real quick because i feel like you know first kiss always sets things off and then we're gonna friend zone her this is throwing mixed signals i'm sorry <laughs> this is this is gonna give her poor whiplash and then actually no it's under relationships i believe and let's do change relationship ask to just be friends now you know we don't have any buffs at the moment and the poor girl this poor thing let me see Best thing. romantic satisfaction ends not the double dang it's all gone so now i think it was mutually so that went better than expected from friend zoning a sim i told them and they understood why we shouldn't continue to flirt there wasn't any confusion either we even made plans to hang out as friends cool and then it says just friends houston won't forget the day they friend zone a sim is this it social oh friends on a sim houston just friends on cassandra goth houston just told cassandra goth that it's better to just be friends with cassandra goth at carperdale they did it in high school love this okay cassandra has the same thing we're gonna quickly add her to the household and <laughs> not the emoji <laughs> she's like what okay it says true courage from being friend zoned by a sim when it, while it hurts i respect they approached me and cared about our friendship it's why the lines between friendship and romance got blurry for a minute there i can see why someone would fall in love with them oh so cool 
cool there's a milestone okay she did get a milestone herself um but yeah so unfortunately cassandra you have to leave the household i'm sorry you are the weakest <laughs> let me stop we love you cassandra and let's try someone else Ooh, where is that i don't want to break his heart but wolfgang over here wolfgang was yelling at people and we didn't really like that so we're going to play with his feelings real quick you shouldn't you should never do this okay don't don't play with people's feelings okay don't do that for the sake of this video we're going to do that and let me just uh excuse me sir but what's your name it's something about the red hair the red and the you know Ooh, this Simmons is a tool. Houston has a major crush on Wolfgang. I'm screaming! Oh my god, so it was. Oh, I feel so bad because I'm about to do this. I feel so bad. Um, <laughs> so let's do 70 and then a little 40 maybe, you know? Romantic satisfaction begins. I wonder if you can cheat the romance satisfaction menu. Probably, probably. Um, I'm also gonna add Wolfgang to the household real quick, add to family, and let's uh maybe a hundred. I kind of wish that we still had the different values for Sims, because apparently back in the day, because I knew I was not tripping. Sims had different values, so somebody could you know see you as a friend at seventy, but you know reality is like you're the you're their best friend, but you're not there best friend you know so they like you more than you like them type of deal and you know not everything was the same Ooh, actually because houston has the crush on wolfgang but you know it's kind of vice versa we're gonna do uh ask to just be friends on wolfgang's part and see because he does have a crush on him so i really don't want to do it in this you know, i won't do this with everybody including the principal but you know it is what it is and i wonder if anything will come of it we got something different and it says oh it was fun flirting with you look i enjoyed myself but we are friends and it's kind of silly if we take it further i'm screaming and now we have there was that from being friends down by a sim i guess i misread that and my friend set the boundary that we are meant to only be friends i'm okay with that i'm screaming um and then i don't think there's anything else uh smooth talker having a crush yeah i think that's it i think that's the only thing that the milestone should be here the milestone and it says friend zone of sim at copperdale so yeah this mod is so cute i believe this is a must-have mod honestly low-key but go check out this mod from sasha space and let's move on to the next mod all right boo that is the end of this video i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more sims 4 mods if you made it to the end put the light bulb emoji and i'll see you next time bye boo